Five minutes. The chair now recognizes the gentleman from New Hampshire. Mr. Speaker, I rise today in support of my amendment to the Commerce, Justice, and Science Appropriations Bill to increase the funding for our nation's drug courts by $5 million. I rise today to stand with veterans throughout the country and offer a simple amendment that seeks to bolster funds in this act for the Veterans Treatment Court Initiative. And then the other thing that I think is so important are the drug courts. Uh, this amendment would increase funding for Veterans Treatment Courts by $1 million. I led the effort in my home state to create drug courts. I believe we need to increase federal resources to these critical programs nationwide. And they worked uh, spectacularly well in many places throughout the country. Drug courts are transforming the criminal justice system across our nation. I've seen firsthand in Maine the difference that these courts can make. Fortunately, specialized veterans treatment courts are being developed across the country. Or that it really has been the states who have been showing us by example how effective drug courts can be. Today there are more than 11,000 vets enrolled in veterans treatment courts. They are doing an amazing job with a team of professionals really truly saving one life at a time and providing a last chance for our veterans. My amendment would increase by $3 million the amount appropriated for fiscal year 2015 for the drug courts program. We don't have to waste taxpayer dollars warehousing people in jail. They reduce crime and restore families. Quite simply, drug courts work. We don't have to be content with a system that isn't effectively serving the people it's supposed to. The drug court approach reduces crime by as much as 45%. We have programs to help and save money. For every dollar invested in drug courts, taxpayers save as much as $27 when compared to the historic approach. He makes a very powerful case. But that's the beauty of the drug court. I think it makes a lot of sense. I just think this is something that deserves our support. So I accept the amendment, I think it's a good amendment, and yield back. Gentleman yields back.